Yo guys, welcome back to another video on our channel and today we're going to be taking a look at the best SA87 class setup in Warzone. Chat was telling me to try this gun out a couple times, I was like no it's not going to be any good, I've tried it before, it wasn't great. And then they were saying it's actually a lot of fun to use so try it out, I tried it out and this is actually one of the best guns in the game right now. The times kill is crazy, it's got no recoil, the mobility is not even bad considering it's an LMG. I definitely recommend you guys give this a go. But quick before we do jump into the class setup guys, if you are new around here be sure to subscribe to the channel with notifications turned on to miss any more videos on the channel. If you do enjoy the video please do smash big thumbs up as it really does help me out and let me know your thoughts on this SA87 in the comments below. As usual I'll show you guys the attachments we do run and I'll show you guys a bunch of clips at the end of the video but I'm gonna jump straight into it right now. So guys obviously with being a modern warfare gun the first attachment we are going for is going to be the monolithic suppressor. It's going to take off the radar when you are shooting and also increase that damage range as well. I mean you can do a lot of damage at people that are further away. This gun like I said before hasn't got a lot of recoil so when you are shooting at distance very easy to hit your shots and obviously having that added effective damage range is going to mean the time to kill at that distance is going to be a lot faster. I mean you can take people the game this gun's not too bad up close either so if you do get caught out in a situation where you are up close with the gun it can still fry people but it's definitely best at like mid to long range that's where it really starts to frag out and it really shows itself as a difference from some of the other ARs in the game to being one of the better ARs within the game now guys in terms of the barrel we are going for the SA87 25.4 inch factory which increased the damage range once again as I just said it's got no recoil it's going to allow you to win those long range gunfights the added bullet velocity means it's going to be even easier to win those gunfights because the bullets aren't going to drop off and it's going to carry that damage all the way through the bullets going to be doing the max amount of damage they can possibly be doing when they are hitting your enemies at all kinds of ranges and it's going to help in control that recoil as well guys like i said the gun doesn't have a lot of recoil and obviously the recoil attachments that we do put on the gun do help control that recoil allowing you to be more accurate and allowing you to win those longer range gunfights allowing you to do more damage at range etc etc they all tie in together they all work together allowing you to win those long range gunfights get a really good time to kill have a good gun that's going to actually start wiping people out of the game nice and quickly Obviously, when it comes to the optic, guys, I'm going for the VLK three times. You guys know I absolutely love this sight. It's perfect for all kinds of distances. At long range, it's a little bit more zoomed in than a standard scope, so it's nice and clear at distance. You can see people off in the distance clearly. I mean, you can hit those shots, take people out of the game. However, like I said, because this gun's not too bad up close, if you do get caught in a situation where you're using it up close, it's decent up close. And because the sight isn't too zoomed in, it's easier to track people. You're not going to start losing focus like you do when you get like a four or five times on it, because then it's too zoomed in. It really throws you off of where you are. But the three times isn't like that. It's good for up close gunfights and those long range gunfights that you are going to be getting into as well. Obviously, with it being a Modern Warfare gun, we're going for the Commando foregrip on the underbarrel. It's going to help control that recoil so much more than any of the other underbarrels. I've tried it. I keep experimenting with the underbarrels, and I always come back to the Commando. I just think it's the best recoil controlling attachment that you can put in any of the guns. Commando foregrip, obviously, as it says, recoil stabilization and aiming stability, which also means while you're RADS, it is going to be a lot more stable. It's not going to be swaying around too much. You might have noticed some from some of the attachments, the cons are like movement speed, ADS speed. However, we do sort of make this up in some areas, but it also isn't actually too slow. It's not too noticeable. It's still got good ADS speed, it's still got good movement speed, and you can really notice this in the clips I'm about to show you, and when you do start using it yourself. And finally, guys, we're going for the 60 round mags. Obviously, with it being an LMG, I don't really understand why it's in the LMG section when the biggest mags you can possibly put on it are 60 round mags. But the biggest magazines you can put on, as I just said, are the 60s. So we're gonna chuck that on. Um Obviously, it's a good amount of bullets. Easily wipe an entire squad with the 60 rounds just because the amount of damage the bullets do do within the game. But here's a full overlook at the class out right now, guys. If you do want to pause it, go make it in your game. Go and do that right now. Like, it's a lot of fun to use. Definitely would recommend giving this class a try if you haven't used it before. It's a lot of fun. It's a really good gun. It's got good time to kill. got good mobility. It's got no recoil, as I keep saying. And at distance, it does all kinds of damage as well. So definitely recommend giving this a go if you haven't already. If you're trying to work out which guns to use. Or maybe when the MG82 gets nerfed, you might want to try this one out. But yeah, guys, hopefully you have enjoyed the video. If you have skipped this part of the video, guys, please make sure you are subscribed with notifications to not miss any more videos on the channel. We upload every single day, 6 p.m. UK time, so make sure you don't miss any of those. If you have enjoyed the video, please do smash a big thumbs up, as it really does help me out. And let me know your thoughts on this SA87 in the comments below. If you guys want to watch me on Twitch, where I stream live pretty much every single day, or you want to watch on my other channels, or check me out on social media, all my links will be in the description. You guys can go and check them out. Go follow me wherever you want to keep updated with what I'm doing. I appreciate you guys watching until the end. I'm going to show you some clips now, and we'll catch you on the next one in a bit. Bye. Vibes. I'm gonna use a slinger. Okay. Okay. Oh, that seems on bar. He was Why terrible. Why are you that? That's a full team. I don't know, when his shot looks like that, it's, it's brave. Right, there's another bar in front of him. Wait, just kind of dope stuff. One shot, nice. Oh, mate, I'm gonna lose my rag in a minute. How long did I play with you? One shot, is. down. Boys, just come and split us somehow. Let's get gone. Let's you sound really quiet, um, Harold. Yeah, he just landed in front of us. Yeah. You got me. Oh yeah, I put my mark to mute. I can't run. Down. He's a bullet. Yeah. Ah! Target 
Because the bounty is off. Bad idea, man. Imagine, that could be kind of busted, you know. I'll be down for a week of just taking Indian food. Oh, don't get it. Don't get it twisted. I'm kind of there for it. Armed mobile. I don't have a team shooting at them. Yeah, they don't worry. Uh... Oh, ghost is pushing them down. Get on the wall. Down. Oh, I'm Wait, there's kids ghosted. Yeah, kids ghosted. Yeah, there's a fault to me. I mean, yeah, I said it. Did you not hear me, Dabble? You not hear me? No. Did call it, bro. I didn't hear that, bro. Try to go. I hope he's home. Don't know. I haven't got a scuba. I'm scared. I shit out No, no. Oh, there's, two, there's three teams on me. There's three, there's three teams on me. Alright, look, come on, two seconds. Let me just get this off. I think I'm good to get to Fed Hour on this wall. Shit. Where they all gone? I'm driving. Uh, I'm good to get that. Nah, you, you're scrapping it now. Hi with the rescue! Oh, Luke! Oh, yes, go, Luke. Big res. Oh, shit. Sniper's at a uh, sleeper. Crossing. Our choppers fall. Requesting area recall. UAV entering the area. Oh, really One down, I'm sorry. He's throwing grenade. Ah! He's running away. Yeah, he's. Nice. They're gone. Uh, uh not. I think he's got self as Who what, where, where, what? 